this is turning out to be the, the most difficult part of this job <sighs> my goodness I just had to show you guys this one oh my gosh hi viewers as mentioned in my last video today I'm going to be replacing my thermostat on the 2003 to 2007 Honda Accord I bought the OEM it came with the housing it also has the seal easy job this is really preventive maintenance. I don't have any overheating issues, but my kite is over 250,000 miles. So yeah, I just want to throw this in. Now let's get this. You don't need much tools. Size 10 wrench, short extension. This is about, let's say about four inches or so. Needle nose clamps, just to remove some tabs that are holding the wire to the alternator, which we'll have to remove, and then flat tip screwdriver, that's all. First thing to do is to drain your coolant. I've already done that. Incidentally, I'm doing some other stuff, so I've drained the coolant. So the location of the thermostat is right there. So that's the thermostat in its housing. It's held by three bolts. So that's the first bolt there. This one, by this, just by this pipe, is the one underneath. And then the last one is that one that's there. So those are the three size 10 bolts I'm trying to take out. The first thing I want to do is to get this cable for the alternator out of the way. So I go in with these snap ring removers and yeah, that's free. Next, using a screwdriver, pry back this hook. Right, that opens that up. I am ready to remove the radiator fan hose. Um, I need some degree of effort, especially since this is the first time I'm pulling out this one. So this is turning out to be the most difficult part of this job but it's coming out anyway i'm using this extension bars leverage <sighs> my goodness so that's out great i just had to show you guys this one oh my gosh now that that's gone you're going to get this bolt That's broken free. For this other one, I go under the AC piping. That's loose as well. And the last one. So here's why it's good to always have these metal pickup things one of those bolts fell into the engine the three bolts they are all the same so none is different from the other then we go ahead to remove the thermostat so it's come out but um, it has a plastic let me show you so it has this thing this square hole where one of the tabs for the wire to the alternator is attached to So that's out. And the thermostat is out. So this is exactly the same, same rating, 78 degrees centigrade, same thing. Yeah, so we replace with the new one. Just one thing to note. So this square part stays on top, so it fits like this. So a new one goes in. Install the bolts. Next is to torque down to spec. Note that the torque on these thermostat bolts are in miserly 10 Newton meters. Allow the O rings to do their job. And don't tighten until you can tighten no more. So you reconnect the lower radiator hose, push that in, it 
make sure you've pushed it all the way when it goes all the way you stop seeing this stump this stump this one here and that's happened you push back this clip to lock everything in place pull that sits in place so you're good next is to refill the coolant So inspecting for leaks, I see no leaks, looks good, I reconnect this and that's it. So thank you very much, if you like this video please subscribe, leave a comment, like the video as well, cheers.